Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you what a section three question looks like. This is particularly helpful if you're new to the GAMSAT. Now, before we get started, I would really appreciate it if you hit the like and subscribe button. This way, more people will be able to benefit from these type of videos. Now, here we have a typical section three question, and we've got three main parts, the stimulus, the question stem, and the answer options. The stimulus is where the bulk of the information is. You're presented with information in various formats, including text, mathematical, tables, diagrams, and graphs. And this has pretty much all of those things. Now, it's a common mistake to be hyper-focused on the stimulus. And I talk a bit about this in my other videos. But it's not the most important part of the question. This leads me to the question stem. The question stem is typically shorter and it's more instructional. In my opinion, this is where the question begins. And then you've got the answer options. Section three is multiple choice and you will have four alternative options. And your job is to choose the one that is most appropriate given what has been asked of you from the question stem and also the information provided in the stimulus. Now, you're not penalized for wrong answers, so it's always a good idea to put in a guess, even if you don't know what the answer is. What I like to suggest to my students is to always start off by looking at the question stem and the answer options. That way, you'll be primed so that when you go to the stimulus, you'll know exactly what to look for. If you'd like to know how I solve GAMSAT section three questions, then please have a look at this video. Otherwise, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.